The earth will run red with blood! Hello and welcome everyone, our heart here with part 38 to my Yellow Turban Let's Play with Huang Shao, Total War Three Kingdoms. We continue where we left things off last time. Thank you once again for your comments, advice, tactics and suggestions. They're all greatly appreciated, do keep them coming. So picking things up where we left them last time at the start of a new turn. So let's kick things off today by sending our missile army over to the Pengcheng Temple to reclaim it from Cao Cao. There's no garrison so we can go straight on in and occupy, lovely stuff. Now as for this missile army, one or two of you weren't sure how viable it's going to be in the long run considering it lacks any dedicated melee infantry. Uh, what I'm going to try with the next battle that we have with this missile army is to not put the Bringers of Righteousness into mixed missile formation, just have them in their regular formation, just see if they hold the front line any better like that. Because uh, I think mixed missile just uh, obviously separates them between melee units at the front and uh, archers at the back and it doesn't give enough sort of holding staying power at the uh, at the front line uh we'll just experiment with this army have a bit of fun it's something a bit different for my other armies though i will stick to just two retinues featuring some kind of uh, missile or archer units for now and we'll probably most of them stick to keeping the reclaimers as our melee infantry although this army one or two of you are recommending i look at yeah, this one, Call for Warriors Reform, which we can do, we can start it next turn, because that unlocks the Yuxia, which are heavy sword infantry. Their role is frontline and they have good armor plus guerrilla deployment, so they could uh, fill that dedicated melee infantry gap uh, rather nicely for us. So yeah, we'll, uh, we'll try that out with that army. Let's just go through our notifications. Nine chapters on the mathematical art, I've probably got 50 of those by now. Surely got enough of my own yellow turban library. Okay. We were going to send uh, Pei Yuan Chao to go after this Lubu army that's in the river. Don't think we can quite get in there this turn, unfortunately. Let's see if we can bring He Man to uh, block them off. Yeah, we should be able to catch them next turn, I hope. So we'll see how that goes. Can't currently peace out with, uh, with Lubu. He's uh, he's having none of it. He's a maybe, but minus 54.6. So we need to smash a couple of his armies. Because if we could peace out with him and his vassal Martung, that would sort of secure the west for now and everyone can just jump on Gongdu. Still don't understand how that guy is still alive. Uh, anyway, for the rest of my armies, let's go after Cao Cao's other territories here in Chen. I think that's all he's got left, really. Just the uh, regions in Chen. He's got the farmland, the livestock farm. Oh no, he's got the livestock farm over here, Yangzhou. But that's fine. Let's see if you guys, can you reach that army? Probably going to run away. It, why is it standing? It's ground. Why not run? It's not in force march. Okay, death to you. Down you guys go. Uh, oh, a grey elite. Lovely. Yes, please. Uh, yeah, I'll ransom you guys as well. Expertise. So let's give that to Miss Scholar. Nice. Uh, let's bring you guys yeah, over here. Good. good. And then we can push on this South South Army. We can't have many forces left. Have a look at him. Yeah, then we'll have our borders with uh, Shu Han. In fact, they were. Were they maybe? Yeah. How close to actually wanting. No. That's fine. I don't want to peace out with Shu Han. I want to go after them. That's fine. I'm going to take their territory before they get gobbled up by the uh, Kingdom of Wu. Alright, let's see. Who needs points? By Ting, you can, you're an administrator, aren't you? Yeah, local leader. Go for stability then. Uh, oh, my general. Yeah, in that missile army. Might as well have more expertise. There we go, have that one. Getting closer. A little bit more. Okay. It's fine for now. And oh there we go. Insight. That research rate, and that'll give us a plus five. Expertise. Legendary. Lovely. 
But what is our research rate at now? 395%. Lovely. And uh, we still got one more character rebel officer. Let's go towards insight again over there. Um, can't upgrade that without a reform. Chuck that in for now. You guys are all about commerce here, considering we've got farmland. Interesting. Is that one? Yeah, it's just doing it all. Pop it in. Um, I should probably go via my pop earners. Why are you guys unhappy? population. I need to expand you. We don't have enough food right now. So with that in mind, let's sort by food. Uh, anything to give us more food production right now. Let's give us 24. Lovely. That's straight in there. All right, nothing else we can do there. Henne. So you're just telling me your public order's low. It's about industry and commerce. Have that one. You must have just expanded, I think. It's probably why we've also taken a bit of a hit to our food. Right, we've got no more money left. Everyone, I think, has moved. So, end the turn. Let's see what delight faces. Sao Sao wants people. No, you're going to get death, Sao Sao. That's all I've got for you in my, my bag of gifts. Santa Claus is coming to town, and you've been a bad, bad boy, Sao Sao. Lubu's army is running away. And I don't want to trespass through uh, Yuan Shu land. We'll have to leave it for now. King of Wu and Liu Yan confederated. Uh, okay, yeah. Oh, that vassal. Living in harmony. Good, good. And actually annex their vassal. Interesting. How much land they've actually got. Okay, yeah, he's got... Oh, yeah, did he always have all that through there? Been the major offensive. I didn't think he had all that down there. They were just being blind. That South South territory. Little Term Rebellion's right there. Mm, don't really want to do that. That's just going to put me in a, quite a tight spot. Assignments, we need to assign them next turn. And let's go for call for warriors. Unless I could get military access. If you want to shoot. I might have enough. Oh yeah, we can definitely get it. I have loads of stuff, Jolly. Uh, okay, not as much as I thought, but hang on, I've got. To, I'm gonna have some books there, but I'm just gonna give you this feather fan. Okay, I'm gonna give you this feather fan, and I'll give you this wooden dog. Perfect. New Pooh's army will never see us coming. Bye bye. Now, you know what? I'll release you. And I'll release you. You're still alive. Um, I have to worry about the Bandit Queen, so yeah, we might as well have all the armies that I can. Getting ready to push against King Mishu Han. Take the Chen farmland.
30 food. I was going to say, taking all this Chen territory is going to yield some nice farming boons. You guys are just holding your ground. I know we don't need to fight that if we still resolve it. We're going to run. Yeah, we can catch you. Probably won't have another battle that we'll really need to fight unless Lu Bu suddenly sends a massive force down the Yellow River. Probably won't be until we come up against uh, Xu Han's main forces. That really depends if they're where they are. If they're all down here on campaign against Kingdom of Wu, we'll be able to storm on through and take uh, the Emperor's seat fairly easily. I think with you, I'm going to get you ready to go after this guy. Shang Chao, you're unfortunately just kind of just there. You're just in the way. So you're going to you're going to die. Sorry, not sorry. We won't go for another army just yet. I think we're fine as we are. Let's um, force march you guys around here, though. Triple officer, go for that one, because then insight is down there. These, um, I'll upgrade those without reform, so I need to probably look at those soon, food wise. I don't want to upgrade any settlements until I spent a fair bit of time investing in our food production, making sure it's as uh, high as possible. Probably not go for that one. Okay, don't bother upgrading that just yet. Um, you guys are all about commerce and a little bit of industry. Get your artisan for commerce. That does, yeah, commerce and industry. There we go. Everybody's moved. At least finish off Sal Sal today. Thinking maybe just to make Lubu submit, it might be worth sending, say, He Man and pay you on Chow just on a little bit of a rampage towards Lubu to break him good and proper. Wonder if that's worth the uh, distraction or not. Have a quick look at Lubu willingness to peace. Any lower? Yeah, a little bit now we defeated that army, so if we can smash a force down that would be good let's send let's send pay on chao oh can i reach them i can good yeah might as well wipe this army out and then we'll bring he man over to help out find Shao. Head over that way. What's that take Lubu down to? Okay, only a tiny bit. I mean, I've got enough items I can probably offer him. But so we don't have to give him everything.
坚如盾牌，势如利刃。保持镇定，齐心协力。Send both these guys this way. Send. Okay, can we do it? Fair war issue declaration. Garrison's fairly large. Let's uh, siege them. And see if they sally out to us. I imagine they will. There it is. Local leader. Um. Buh, 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 buh. Let's go for that. More commerce income. More food, if you please. And uh, more of that. What do we need for that one? Over there, okay. Don't need to go past the third tier on any of that for now. And for that one, what do we need? We need uh, income from industry. Okay, yeah. I'll we'll probably start going for all of those soon. Is it literally just all those buildings left to do? No, hang on. There we go. That's probably not enough money. Good. Right. Everybody moved again. In turn. See. If they sally out against me. Yang Chao. Okay, there's there's a Lubu army. Kong, you're desperately trying to get home now. Yep, they're coming out. In we go. Wajin A reinforcement coming in from there. We can see the settlement off in the background. Nice, 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 nice. trees over there. Begin. Pull my arch that in front. Start with. Crossbows look awesome. Although, let's take you off skirmish mode, please. Triple speed it till they decide they're going to wander towards us shuffle the whole army over to the right a little bit got time so no rush warriors out in front trebs pulling back i can't see anyone 
because I can't see anyone. Send them forward altogether. Why not? I'm going to look at these Watchmen of the Peace. These look awesome with those massive shields. You come. Bring it on. Their cavalry is over on the left, so I'm going to swing mine over there. Along with him. He can do his disorientate lockdown. Nobody wants to duel. Much sadness. Go for those crossbows. Getting absolutely shredded. Cavalry, what's happened to you guys? Infantry Charge Mob that mounted saber cavalry. Crossbows pull back. How witty, how very witty. Go, go.
need to take out a sentinel and he can get over there and heal that one. It'll be very close though. Okay, very close there. There we go. Boom. Oh. Fallen relative. Quickly. Quickly. And do you heal? That was close. Ruddy Ek, that was close. Oh, just clutched it back. Wow. Very, 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 very close. Get him, Watchman of the Peace. Bring him down, bring him down, bring him down. Twenty-four K versus eight point five, nice. And slam into the back of the G militia. Lovely. Really close again. No, he's got it. He's got it. Finish her. Come on. And there we go. There's the finish. Oh, he had to work for it. These spears that have been going at it for ages. There we go. They finally break. There's the victory. Cool, hard fought. Made me work for it. We got him in the end. 455, 328, 386, 477 with the Watchman of the Peace. Archery Master's doing well too. Yeah, lovely stuff. I think they're the better combo than Bringers of Righteousness. Um... We will go for replenishment, considering we still need to order resolve that siege. Oh no! Died of old age. In my missile army. Damn it. Natural causes. How old is uh, 69? Yeah, one or two of you saying you're not sure he's going to last um, to see uh, all of China under the uh, yellow turban rules. So it'll have to be carried on by uh, E Man and Her Yi. How old is Her Yi? 53. Before, yeah. So who, who is actually my heir? Get. Yeah.
Oh, really? I still can't get that. Yes, I can. It's a close victory. Boom. Death. Uh, replenishment. Onjo. You are a vassal of your shoes. Oh, damn. Uh, actually, can I can I treat with you? If I get military access, you don't need to die. Anything. What's that one? Okay. Give you another one of the books. And. Book of Songs. And if I then give you a little bit of money. Perfect. I can go through your territory and put pressure on Chu Han from another direction. He man. Bandit Queen's already in there. Bandit Queen at war with. Uh... No. Where are you going, Bandit Queen? You're actually allied to Chu Han. Interesting. That could lead to some interesting goings on. Finish off Sao Sao. As promised for this episode. Alright. Just his livestock farm. His army's over there. Got all of the commandery. Uh, oh, I can't quite reach you. Damn it. Okay, well, Sal Sal's final fall. We'll have to wait until next time. Let's just take out and chow. That's that faction down. Boom. Right, we got 15k in the bank. We'll uh, spend that at the start of the next episode. Until then, hope you guys have enjoyed. Don't forget to comment, rate, and subscribe. Follow me on Facebook and Twitter, take Paranja the Legion. Check out my affiliates and sponsors, Games Planet, Overclockers UK, and QT. Till the next one, ciao for now.